this is Samantha here from RecipeThis.com and the voice behind the popular kitchen gadgets podcast, Magic with Gadgets. Today I wanted to show you just how easy it is to cook homemade sweet potato fries in the Ninja Foodie using the Ninja Foodie air fryer basket. Well, before we dive into this recipe, I just wanted to suggest that you head over to RecipeThis.com. We've got more than 1,200 kitchen gadget recipes, including recipes for the air fryer, instant pot, slow cooker, soup maker, bread maker, microwave, ninja foodie, and many others. We also have a free weekly newsletter, which you can find on the homepage of RecipeThis.com, or you can find it on RecipeThis.com forward slash newsletter. And there you can get our best kitchen gadget recipes sent to your inbox every Friday morning. All you have to do is pump that in the, in the Ninja Foodie and it's transformed into an air fry for you. So first things first, let's get out some sweet potatoes and start transforming them into fries. I've got a pack here of two uh, from Asda, the fantastic, just for some quick sweet potato fries. And there you go, there's your two sweet potatoes chopped. Peeled, I should say. Now let's chop them. I like them more thinner. But you could also do them thick like steak chips too if you wanted to. So that's half of the sweet potato done now. You can do a smaller portion if you wanted to. You could just do one if you're just feeding yourself. Oh, and you don't have to do fries if you wanted to. You could do wedges or, or baked potatoes or even cubes using the Ninja Foodie. And then the last bit. And that's all the sweet potatoes. They're peeled and sliced now. Move the chopping board out the way and I can show you how to season your sweet potato fries. Right, so mix them up, make sure you haven't got any bits that are too big. So you want an even cook on them. And then add in salt. Pepper. And then you can add in some other seasonings if you want, or just keep them fairly plain. I've gone with fairly plain because I just like salt and pepper on them, just like I do when I have them in a restaurant. And then you want some extra virgin olive oil. You want to aim for two, tea, two uh, teaspoons, which is the equivalent of 10 ml. And then once you've got that in there, you want to give them a quick mix. And now they're ready for the air fryer. So load them into your air fryer basket of your Ninja Foodie. Make sure they're nicely mixed and that they're ready to go. And then you're looking for the air crisp button. And then for the temperature, you want to Move it across to 160 Celsius, that's 320 Fahrenheit, and cook for 25, uh, 20 minutes, sorry. But first, put the air fryer lid down because otherwise it won't start until you do that first. And the Ninja Foodies beeped. Right, so this is the time that what I do is I open the lid and I want to see how fork tender they are. And these are absolutely perfect so far. And now, you know, they've got, they're starting to get a bit of colour on them, but they've not quite got enough. So what I do now is I put them back in, uh, the Ninja Foodie, the lid back down, and we do another five minutes. at a high temperature of 200 celsius that's 400 fahrenheit so it's just doing a quick five minutes just to finish off crisping them up and then you press start just waiting for the beep we've done 25 minutes for our sweet potato fries and there's the beep oh 
wow and these sweet potato chips absolutely look delicious but i'm not finishing it there because you know there's only one way to have chips and that is as cheesy chips so what i recommend you do is you grab some grated cheese what i really love at the moment is the uh 50 percent reduced fat mature cheese from tesco's it's absolutely delicious and i use it a lot in the air fry at the moment so just add a layer of cheese to the top as much cheese as you want and then how cheesy you like them and then we're going to change the time on this and put it down to two minutes and then we can just see how cheesy our delicious sweet potato chips are oh and wow the cheese is melting perfectly there oh what is it about melted cheese on things so let's check that out oh wow doesn't that look fantastic it's just melted so if you want it more melty then you can add an extra minute but i think that's perfect amazes me how many sweet potato fries or sweet potato chips as you might call them you can cook at once in the ninja foodie right so that's all of them wow look at those don't they look fantastic oh wow look at that melted cheese isn't that lovely mm. i could eat these every day and amazingly, they're actually suitable for Weight Watchers, which I'm on. Mm. Oh, they're so nice. If you want something simple, using the air fryer function on the Ninja Foodie, then try some homemade sweet potato fries. Thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to the Recipe This family. You can find us on Twitter, Facebook and Pinterest. We also have a weekly newsletter at recipethis.com forward slash newsletter where we share with you our latest kitchen gadget recipes, what we're cooking in the Milner kitchen and so much more. As well as this, we recommend that you subscribe to our YouTube channel and then whenever we have a new video, you will be the first to know. And if you want to know about all our future videos, then I recommend you hit the bell for instant notifications. But even better, we now have a podcast. It's called Magic with Gadgets. Simply search Magic with Gadgets on your favourite podcast player and you'll find us there. 